Hi, this is Debbie with the Food Prepping Channel. And today I'm going to show y'all a recipe, simple recipe, but I'm fixing two things. I have two things of sausage, um, ganoze, mild sausage, and ganoze, hot sausage. And I'm going to take both of these... And put them in my pan here. Pot, pan, whatever you want to call it. I'm going to start this on medium high. Whoops. This is going to be a, a different dish. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix both of these sausages together. I'm going to use half of it, half of the sausage for a pizza for lunch for us. And then the other thing that I'm going to fix tonight is this is a um, sausage <laughs> macaroni casserole. Let's just put, it, let's just say that. Sausage macaroni casserole. <laughs> but I'm going to fry this sausage up. And I'm going to take my potato pillar and mash it. That's the best way to get it all mixed together and get it um, crisp, crisped up and broken up into smaller pieces. And I'm going to let this cook. And while this is cooking, I'm going to be fixing some macaroni, and I'm going to get it al dente, which is just um, almost done, but not quite. And um, when I get that back, when I get finished with all this, and this gets this sausage gets cooked, I'll bring you back. Okay, there's my sausage. And it's all cooked up, and there wasn't any grease in it. And here's my macaroni, and my macaroni noodles, and I've cooked them, and I've just got one big hunk of butter in here. Oh, I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> Country crock shed spread with calcium. I've got that in, in here, and I've got to, I'm in the middle of doing two things, so I will bring you back when I get ready to finish this and um, get it in the oven. I've got my oven preheating to 400. All right, there's my pizza. This is the um, kind of dough that you get in the roll. I think it's Pillsbury dough. It's, you have to roll it out onto the pan, and then I put, um, the, I cooked it for a few minutes in the oven and got it a little bit brown, and then I put the pizza sauce on there, Parmesan cheese, a lot of Parmesan cheese, half of the sausage, um, a lot of the mozzarella cheese, and then pepperonis on top, and I'll let this cook until it, it gets done. That was for lunch. All right, now here is the macaroni, and I'm going to put, um, I'm going to put the rest of this. I wasn't going to do it like this, but I've got the rest of this pizza sauce, so I'm going to put the rest of this pizza sauce in here. And it's not very much, um, but I'm going to put that in here. And then I'm going to put, um, hold on, I'm, let me bring you right back. Okay, I poured the half, the other half of the um, can of pizza sauce in here. And this wasn't what I was going to do, but I just decided to go on and do it. Now I'm going to put the sausage in here. Remember, I've got the shed spread in here. And I'm going to put the sausage in here and mix it all up. 
and I'm gonna put oh, some milk in here. If I can get it open. Got two percent milk, and you might know it's got one of those little tops on it, and I can't get it off. Okay, I'm gonna use about a half a cup of milk in here. And then I have mozzarella cheese. And this is kind of like a, <laughs> a um, it's not a pizza casserole and it's not like macaroni and cheese, but it's just a sausage casserole. And I'm going to put a lot of mozzarella in here. I'm going to put the rest of this back in here. Stir this all up. And I'm going to grease my pan. I've got some olive oil and I'm just gonna put some in there. I've got a casserole dish. Are you showing? Alright, I've got a casserole dish and I've got a paper towel and I'm just gonna grease the bottom of this. And I'm going to put, let's hope it fits in here. Alright, I'm going to have to bring you back because i got to get a bigger pan. Alright, I had to get a bigger um, baking sheet, so, I mean not a, a pan. <laughs> So, I'm going to wipe the olive oil around the bottom of it so it doesn't stick in this one. And I do have to put some more milk in here. So, it's going to end up with about a cup of milk. And I've got to put salt and pepper in here. And my hands are greasy. So that makes it even harder to do. Okay, there's the pepper. And here's the salt. But remember, the sausage has already got salt in it, and of course you salted, I salted the macaroni. So I'm going to see if this pan is big enough. Let's hope so. This will be <laughs> leftovers for a couple days. This is going to be our dinner tonight. I'm going to fix a salad to go along with it. So, it's just a, it's really good. It uh, doesn't have any cheddar cheese. We didn't, I, I don't want to put any cheddar cheese in it. I'm just going to put the mozzarella because I want it to be stringy. It's just, it's really good. And you can see now that it's really not, after I put the milk in there and the um, margarine, and now it's really not that much pizza sauce in there. It was just half a can to, to begin with. So I'm going to put this in the oven um, for, it's on 400, it's heated to 400, and let this cook, and I'll let you know how long it's going to take when it's done. All right, there's what's left of my pizza. Everybody's done got some. And here is the sausage casserole. That's what we're going to call it, the sausage casserole. It is amazing. But I've got just a little bit. This is for dinner, like I said. But um, my daughter's going to taste it and see what she says about it. Um, I, it's just so good. 
So good. It, it, it is, I mean, it's the first time she's had it. So I'm going to taste it now because I used to make it years and years and years ago. And I just had all the sausage that I needed to use before it went out of date. So I said, I'm going to go on and fix the pizza for lunch and the sausage casserole for dinner. And like I said, with the sausage casserole, I'm going to fix a salad. I'm going to take my bite. Mm. This is so good. It's like macaroni and cheese, but it has sausage in it and the milk and the butter and, the, and no cheddar cheese. There, my daughter is getting another bite. She likes it. <laughs> and this is so good. And all it is is I used ganache sausage. Um, since I was fixing a pizza, I fixed one pound of ganache hot and one pound of ganache mild and, um, cooked that up, used my potato masher to cook that up and get it browned. Then I, you know, I used half of it for the pizza, cooked the macaroni noodles and, um, got them all to, they were just al dente, almost done, but not quite. Then I mixed a big hunk, <laughs> that's all I'm going to say, it's a big hunk of butter. Um, well, you know, I don't use butter, it's margarine, but I've always said butter. <laughs> don't I don't know why, but anyway, it's margarine. Um, I used a big hunk of margarine, <laughs> about a cup of milk, um, an eight ounce bag of mozzarella cheese, and the sausage and put it in the oven on 400 cooked it um, for 20 minutes on 400 then cut it down to 300 and cooked it for another 10 minutes and this is it. I mean it really is delicious it's gonna be so good tonight with the salad so if you like my recipe give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and you have a good day bye